hello guys welcome back to my little series of like thrifting of winter coats that i thrifted throughout the season we're in the first day of spring so i'm gonna show you what i got during winter which is gonna take me into the next year let's hopefully that i do not find anymore because if you if you're like me and start getting into thrifting you'll realize that it's a treasure hunt, so you're not going to find the same thing. Like if you go to an actual store and they have the same item, just different size. This one is just like one of a kind. That's why it's called treasure hunting. So let me get into I'm going to show you the very, very first one that I thrifted. And I'll tell you where I get them. So this one is a trench coat. And I actually got this one at savers and what i love about this it's actually comes with a second piece in and it's pretty warm um i still want to wear it like if it was like 24 degrees outside but i wish i could do something with this hair but let's just show you how i actually wore it. let me get a little bit closer so it's more like a soft like suede fabric it has that little back details i love the buttons on it and when i wear it i just pretty much do a tie like that and yeah so let me show you the next one that i found this one i actually paid a, a bit of price for it i got it at goodwill and I didn't want to leave it behind it wasn't on sale at that particular day it wasn't but i fell in love with it i actually went and had it dried clean because it's real suede um fox fur on the inside but it was very stiff when i got it now oh shoot i still got my glove in there um <laughs> it was very like stiff so i got it back and it feels very soft very buttery and this jacket is so warm, I literally only need to wear a t-shirt. That's how warm it is. The sunlight in here is beaming on me, so it makes me look orange against this. But yeah, right? This was so cute. I adore this jacket, but like I said, it's super warm. So you only need to wear a t-shirt under it, which that's what I do. The next one, I'm not going in any particular order here. The next one that I went crazy for the store with this one, I saw it at Goodwill and I was like, I don't know, let me leave it. And I left it. And it was one of those things that you see and you'd be like, why the hell did I not get it? Can I tell you the next day I went back and it was there and I was like, what the living, living hell is made for me? So this coat is like how they used to make coats back in the days that looked like a dress. So I'll button it up for you so you could actually see. So it literally looks like a dress with those pleats right there, right? And then when you get closer, it's pleats at the back too, which as you can see, that nice little detail thing, that's what pretty much got me is the detail on it and the sleeves were huge. Like, so I feel like I could actually wear this as a dress. No one will ever know if I'm wearing anything under it. So the next one that I like, which I went a little bit crazy with these jackets. Seriously, I did. This green one. Hunter green. This one had shoulder pads. Mind you, I did actually take them and get them dry clean because I did not want to mess them up. This one is a bit oversized, but I don't mind because I do love them oversized. And I took the shoulder pads out. As you can see, it's pretty huge, but it's okay. <laughs> now the next one which i was like what was 
well i'm gonna have a lot of what moment but this one is a wool rich jacket it's fully lined this one is really warm too and this one is a men's but i still love it y'all my husband who does not wear jackets was like i like that jacket can i wear it sometimes i'm like sure honey i wear your shit all the time you could borrow mine and this one is huge and it actually fits him he has like big arms because he lifts weights so his arms are bulky and this one fits him perfect but he only could borrow it sometimes so if i'm over it like i'm over it i'm like honey you have it but let me see which one Yo, something hit me oh it must be that then this one every time i wear it i get so much compliment it's actually reversible so you can wear it on this side if you want to i choose to wear it on this side because i like this side better it's quilted and it's still pretty warm and how cute is that very cute let me get a little bit closer so you can see that design i might look like i'm wearing my grandmother's curtain but who cares it's cute well to me it's cute i think i have about three more three more to show you well this one again like at times i will see it and i'll leave it but i love how it has like this line and this one was never worn because it still had the tags on it and it's actually purple but it's a it's showing up really 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 lighter here but this one is so cute never mind my child he screams like that i don't know why but this one is so cute and i love that detail at the back like i was saying it i still didn't even open it that's how this person never wore it and I think it still has a tag on it on the inside and i think i got this for 15 seven dollars to be exact and i got it at the salvation army and the original tag on the inside because i didn't take it out yet hold on let me see if i find it it's inside the sleeve so i don't hold on let me see what department store this came from so this was at tj maxx and it was at TJ Maxx for one thirty, and I got it for seven bucks. Deal! Ow, 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 ow. So I'm gonna show you this red leather. I don't know. I just kind of like this red leather. It was a little bit. I felt like it was blah, but I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna have a moment where I'm gonna be like, I'm rocking red. So I own a leather and a wool and a red. And this one was um, from Savers. It was a good deal too. Some things you just can't leave behind, but I promise, I promise like, <sighs> who am I lying to? I'm gonna stop buying secondhand or last like big, no. But really I'm trying to say is, I promise I'm not going to buy any more coats winter is done we're in spring yeah <laughs> okay my last other one is this green trench coat and what i love is like this two-tone on it it seems like you could actually take this off if you want to but i like that and it has like a button is it a zipper a zipper so it actually came with another piece on the inside but of course i didn't find it so it came with a i found a belt actually it was missing the belt but i just put this belt with it and and i planned on i never seem to wear them but kind of get the, the drift of how i will actually wear this my problem is i have monkey arms and i say monkey arms because things always fit me like right up here like you feel like your whole like wrist is like 
naked so i don't like that i like them a little bit longer this one fits good actually my thrifted buddy was like kelly i think that jack will look cute on you and you see that's my hair at the back but i like that and that pleat in the back but let's take this hair out and not only that i love it actually has shoulder pads i don't know i think i might leave the shoulder pads in it it just gives it a more i guess 80s vibes or 90s vibes but i do like this big double breasted look this little thingy on the edge all of that and it's green really normally don't do green but sometimes you can't say no to the green you can't believe green used to be my last name before i got married oh excuse me i made some soup and it's just hitting it's, it's going down so yeah but thank you guys very very much for checking out my little vintage well would you say vintage vintage thrifted finds of outerwear what should i do next do you all dresses let me know catch you later guys